Tomorrow night, 17 people from Colorado or with strong ties to our state will be inducted into the Colorado Authors Hall of Fame. Denver 7's Katie LaSalle gives us a read through of the big event. The Colorado Authors Hall of Fame is a volunteer run nonprofit recognizing Colorado authors past and present. And I'm so excited to be joined now by founder, Dr. Judith Bryles. So you're an author yourself, a book publishing, a marketing expert, among many other right. things. Thank you so yeah. much for being here. And can you start by just telling us more about the hall? You've been celebrating Colorado authors now for years. For, for years. I'm a, I'm a big fan of Colorado authors in general. And years ago, I just, the vision was that I wanted to not have their legacies forgotten. And it's so easy to pass. That's why we do living inductees and legacy inductees. So we always bring up some past. And what's cool about this is they have to have been born here, lived here, come here to write, maybe a retreat or something, or they write about Colorado or they use something here in Colorado um, in their writing. For example, one of the inductees is James Michener this year. I did not know, Katie, that the Michener Library is up in Greeley at the University of Northern Colorado. Oh, and he's one of the inductees. 2021 yes. induction to the mm -hmm. hall is happening on Saturday. Mm -hmm. Can you tell us more about what's planned for this special evening? Well, they eat <laughs> and, and um, they we have a video, a short video of everybody. Um, it's going to be done. Dom Testa will be our MC again, who is a you know an author himself, and he was inducted in 2019. Um, and so we have a meet and greet. Barnes and Noble, who is one of our uh, supporters, will offer books of the inductees, um, and they can get them and get them signed. Each of the inductees will get up. All living inductees will be here in person, which is very exciting, um, and they will share something insightful that could be very poignant or it could be off the wall, hilarious, which happens sometimes. Um, and then of course, you know, there, there's a dinner and then they, we have medallions for them and a beautiful, beautiful book glass award. It's lovely um, that they get, but it's just as it's a memorable evening. So if you love words, if you love books, if you love what authors can make the difference, this is where to be. I'm sure a lot of people watching feel that way. And you mentioned uh, when we were talking earlier before this interview that you have a special honor that was recently given by Denver's mayor and Colorado's governor. We do. Um, uh, governor Polis has uh, proclaimed it as the Colorado Authors Hall of Fame Day. And Mayor Michael Hancock is calling it the um, Authors Hall of Fame Induction Celebration Day. So that's what we're doing. <laughs> Dr. Judith Browse, thank you so much for joining us today. And thank you. thank you for all the organization does for authors. Thank you so much, Katie. Now for more about the Colorado Authors Hall of Fame, including information about the authors being inducted this weekend's during this weekend's induction ceremony, you can go ahead and visit cogreatauthors.org.